And there we go, finally, results are in, so we can open it. And then I think it's time to get the scenery for this section of the park. Maybe I'll start with that uh, water buffalo thing right here.
And there we have it, the water buffalo is complete, turned out pretty good considering the uh, pieces and tools that I have at my disposal. Uh, so as you can hopefully see it's like uh, standing on its hind legs or kneeling down with its front legs in a kneeling position. And the back legs are straight because it's drinking from the water here. So this is the head here, those are the eyes, it's got like green eyes I guess. Although I think uh, it, the, uh, not the pupil but the other area of the eye should probably be black or uh, grey. But then it would probably look less weird or actually more weird, I don't know. Or maybe that works. Although technically uh, most bovine have like completely black eyes or maybe like uh, brown pupils but then it wouldn't stand out from all the rest of here anyway that's the head and this is the black nose and then it's got its antlers up here which were the hardest one of the hardest things to do because there's no uh, really thick uh, diagonal or horizontal stuff so I used uh, these poles here along with these poles the vertical or uh, slanted and horizontal ones and then uh, these railings here uh, hanging from them are supposed to be vines and other stuff that have gotten caught in its uh, horns the fire is just for decoration <laughs> and then its whole back is covered with this moss type of stuff which the flowers and the colored pieces represent and down here on the side and leg we have the lattice supports that uh, represent the mixture of vines and moss and all kinds of plant life growing and hanging from it. And then the um, grey things down here are the hooves of it. And uh, back here we have the tail which is two pairs of poles because just one would so look so puny so added to them. And that's the tail. And the slide itself is down there, and that green stuff is more more vines and plants and other stuff that is stuck down there. <laughs> Looks pretty good, considering the difficulty of building such round shapes and uh, varied things with these base blocks and walls and whatnot. So there we have it, the water buffalo, giant one leaning down to drink some water. Oh, I should add a uh, waterfall coming from its mouth to represent to wa the water that it's trying to drink here. Maybe something like that. Do -do -do -do, coming down, spilling out of the mouth. And there we go. Oh man, that took like an hour to make, or even more, but we still have all this here. So I don't know if I'll have the energy to complete it in this session. We should save it for the next one. Do a big old time lapse for this whole area here. Yeah, I think I'll save that for next time. So once again, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.